Okay, who's gonna pull the carriage? Eh? What's up, everybody? My name is Molly Hua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host of podcasts across worlds, and I stream on twitch.tv slash Lehua Superfina. Today, we are reacting to In a Land of Leado, and if you like anime reactions, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, so you can be notified on the next upload, and if you like to support the channel, we got Patreon, channel membership, and merchandise. Link to those are below. We are reacting to In the Land of Leada episode 11. Cute. He's like, I'm not a lady. Aww, she's going to introduce them as siblings. An introduction, a carriage, a maid, and moving. Oh, are we going to see the maid that the, was it, um, tartar sauce said don't summon? Yeah, she said cues. She was almost gonna say cues. Why are you so surprised that she adopted? My my one chan. <laughs> She's like, I love the sound of that. <laughs> I think my my is just super expressive. Ooh, are you having the hots for the butler? Dang, you're making her sound like she's had a very eventful... <laughs> She, she, she just said it! Your life is eventful! <laughs> oh, she's gonna build a house! This is the one that people were talking about in the comments. Grew up carefree and surrounded by nature. <laughs> she needs materials. Craft that house. <laughs> <laughs> What is with the stars? That looks dangerous. He's just a weirdo. Hmm. 
I like how expressive they are after they're being called like an older brother or sister. These effects are what make me who I am. They are my identity. <gasps> You're the one who raised me to be this way. Oh, he said it. He called her out on it. <laughs> Is he saying that because he's like, I understand? Or he's like, yeah, I see the resemblance. Don't move your church over there. Just stay where you are. She's always patting him on the head. But I think he likes it. <laughs> it's like a patting head train. Hold it wise. <laughs> yeah, it's not like you'll never see each other. Do you know how many people want her to join them? Lots. She's on demand. Moving will be an expensive proposition. <laughs> Did he just make a sale? <laughs> Uh, beautified by 300%. <laughs> that is so cute. That must be the maid. <laughs> beautified 300%. Oh, same race. It's like a department store. Like Macy's, Sears, JC Penny. Amazon. <laughs> I like how they like put dots on the name for Amazon. <laughs> Because, you know, they might not be able to use it. <laughs> they even, like, make a sound effect so she doesn't even say it. They're not even making a substitute name. <laughs> so is she not able to teleport other people? She's only able to teleport herself. Oh, that thing's been through a lot, huh? Huh? 
Eh? That was a quick reaction. Oh, she's quick on the take. Dang! Let me go ahead and take it. Those are the president's orders? Have your first purchase for free. Wow. Isn't this the most expensive purchase out of everything? Husband! Oh! <laughs> her reaction's just like her kids. <laughs> You're letting her first purchase. Be the carriage that you were going to chuck out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Everybody in the background is like, what is going on? <laughs> Yo, this girl is going to be bored if she's left at home. <laughs> she is not a normal person. The maid! You can ask the maid! Limitations? Why does he have limitations? You're not even sure if you can return there. Like, how come you don't know if you can return there? Like, what's going on? Like, why wouldn't you be able to return there? Oh. Because there's no one maintaining it. So maybe resources have been used up within the system. Is she that unlikable? <laughs> she didn't start these petty squabbles? <laughs> That sounds like it's pretty fun, she says. Oh, she's so mischievous. Uh oh. Like, how much trouble is this made? They have such like a slow effect to her entrance. Uh. Yep, she has the characteristics of a rascal. Oh, look at that hoy, that haughty way of speaking. <laughs> like she's teasing people. Into a fine lady. 
Yeah, you don't need to raise her as a lady. It's like, jeez. She goes pretty extreme, huh? You don't deserve any of that, girl. It comes with the position. Rake in the benefits. Oh, there she goes with the petty squabbles. She started that. Roxane started it! Set an example for Luca. <laughs> She's like prepping them. For where they're gonna live now. Mm hmm, show them who's boss. Yeah. Luca, that's who you wanna be. You're gonna be aspired to be like Kana. Okay, who's gonna pull the carriage? Eh? <laughs> uh, that's a little creepy. I think I would rather have something pulling the carriage. I mean, that looks convenient and all, but that's still a creepy. A horse's head is just sticking out. Even though the horse is made out of wood. I, I, yeah. Would you call that a chimera carriage? Are they around the same age? What do you mean, did that hurt? Is the little girl like super strong or something? Roxilius. Oh, no, 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 girl, stop picking fights. You're picking fights. Stop it. <laughs> You're even not going to let her out. Like, jeez Louise. Like, even Keen is, ex is acknowledging how Roxine is. Run a laundry business. Oh, so she's getting money? She still has to go back home, yeah?
What kind of preparations? Yeah, for what? Welcome party. No alcohol, please. Or maybe there could be alcohol. Kana just has to pace herself. But I feel like every time when she has like a hangover the next day, something happens. Kana, it's not like you have to drink everything that's given to you. So what I mean when I said Kana doesn't have to drink everything that's given to her, it's not like she's on a job. Like she's it's not like she's working where she's obligated to drink everything during like a business outing and such. You know what I mean, Jilla Bean? So it's not like that. It's optional but you know if she gets out of control and just ends up drinking a lot that's a little different <laughs> but this one i think is like an episode just like literally introducing luca to the family and seeing their reactions to her that's what it feels like like I'm really interested what the next episode is going to be, especially if we're unsure what it's going to be about. Like right now, I'm about to look out how many episodes are going to be. Because so this is episode 11. There's only one more episode left. Like, <laughs> what can you put in that? Because she still haven't found all the towers, right? And the mermaid, she needs to find her home village, right? So it's like, uh, okay, so what's the next episode going to be about? Because uh, this episode kind of took up time, okay? It did. <laughs> so it's like giving me an idea how the pacing is. But besides that, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And if you want to talk outside of YouTube, there's a Discord. Link is in the description. I also stream on twitch.tv slash Superfina. Outside of YouTube and Twitch, I host podcasts across worlds where we talk about anime, manga, and other things you're interested in. If you like podcasts like that, link to the podcast is in the description. We're available on all platforms. Other than that, my name is Lihua, and this is the Superfina channel reacting to you in the land of Leodel episode 11. Hope you guys like this video, and we'll see you on the next one. Laters!